what's in the papers, all I seem to see must be something underneath. Take two, I'm still trying to figure out what makes you hard on the call. I guess it comes from your heart, cause when your head's right. <laughs> There are many different species of certain organisms in the environment on our planet that all seem to have specific adaptations for the habitat in which they live in. How did this happen that a group of organisms that seem to be alike could look and act so different? This is believed to be caused by divergent evolution, a process in which descendants of a single ancestor diversify into species that each fit different parts of the environment. This means that each species of each organism must have descended from a common ancestor. Wow! For example, let's say that a small number of greenish brown colored stick bugs arrive on an island as a result of a storm. Then the stick bugs will reproduce and as the population increases, variation will also increase. Some stick bugs might turn out to be more green in color, and some might turn out to be more brown in color. The stick bugs will eventually start moving around to other parts of the island as the population increases as well. As they move around to different habitats, the bugs with a more unfavorable trait in the environment they encounter will die at a faster rate than the ones with the more favorable trait. If there were brown and green bugs that were in a green environment, the brown bugs would die at a faster rate as a result of predation because they're easier to spot in a green environment. And vice versa would happen with the green bugs. They would die at a faster rate in a more brown environment as a result of predation. Because the unsuitable traded bugs are dying at a faster rate, they will eventually die off in that environment altogether while the survivors reproduce and pass on the favorable trait to their offspring. This will eventually cause the bug species to split into several groups that are each adapted to a specific habitat. These groups will then evolve to become a separate species of stick bug. Over a long period of time, this will happen until the population will fill many parts of the environment, which is known as adaptive radiation.